another eBay to Amazon Flipline video for DVD, but let's up the sales rank a little bit. When you need someone easy to talk to, I will be there to give you help. Please change your mind, hold easy. Negativity is not an option. When you need someone easy to talk to, before we get into today's video, I want to introduce you to our sponsor, My Reseller Genie. Here on DIY Dollar Bills, we talk a lot about software that could really help you in your reseller business. Not all of it's really necessary for you to carry on in your business, but this one is necessary. My Reseller Genie is software that helps you with your accounting for your reseller business, account for unlimited selling platforms, have a complete accounting solution, manage your inventory and sales in one place, record your cost of goods, track your sales tax, track your cash flow, account for all of your other business expenses, and so much more. This is a very necessary tool for you with everything that the government is doing with the IRS. GoDaddy bookkeeping is gone and QuickBooks can't really help you the way you need. This is the one solution that you must have for your reselling business. Try My Reseller Genie today. Sign up with the link below and get 30% off your first month. Make sure you use the code DIY Dollar Bills upon sign up to get that 30% off. Made by resellers for resellers. Again, try My Reseller Genie today. It's a must have. What's up everybody? This is Gary D for DIY Dollar Bills and we're gonna do another Flip Mine DVD eBay to Amazon FBA video. So what we what I usually do, what I've done before my past couple, I've used a, of 10,000. Somebody made a comment and I was planning on doing it anyway to that I should maybe up my sales rank um, up. And I was planning to do that anyway. The reason that they said I should do it is because when you have something in that category that's going to sell that quickly and that much, you run a higher risk for counterfeit. And that's true, but that's not the reason I'm going to up it. I'm going to up the sales rank and I'm going to show you something here. So we're going to go to movies. All right. And you'll see my sales rank here is 10,000. So what happens is this limits my ASINs, the amount of SKUs that I can get to send to Amazon. It just limits it. All right. Even the, um, the gate. So this is what I have here. All right. So we'll look at the first one. So you see all the rank here is under 10,000. Right, so this let me see. This is today's date is the fifteenth of December, and we have one, two, three, four items listed for the fifteenth of December on DVDs from eBay under ten thousand rank. Now, so what I did was I did another one, so I put this movies one for twenty five thousand rank. So you could see here it's twenty five thousand. All right, you'll see the ungating here remove all stuff that I'm gated in and now one two three four five six seven eight eight so we've doubled the amount of DVDs that have were listed today but we probably doubled or even higher the amount of DVDs that I can look overall for that I that I can look at and 25,000 is not a bad sales rank it's pretty good it um, I was just being real conservative on my first one because I want to make sure that the stuff sells. But I will probably go higher and higher with my sales rank each time. Um, you know, go, go even a little bit higher. So let's start with Wizarding. Let's start with this Wizarding uh, World 10 Film Connection DVD 20th Anniversary. Let's check it out. It's $23.99. Um, this looks like the actual picture. Is that a crease? Sometimes you can't tell for the picture from a crease. Um, Harry Potter Fantastic Beasts Collection. All right. I got a Harry Potter. Oh, by the way, I, you know, I started getting back into the Amazon uh, several weeks ago, like almost two months. And I have been doing all FBM because the holidays were coming and I didn't want to send stuff that was going to spread out. Well, I converted all my FBM except for two SKUs, which I'm keeping here to sell. Um, it's in a box. It's going to UPS tomorrow. And it's getting sent out, so now I'm going to start getting in the groove of this for the new year, and um, and really start uh, kicking this off. All right, I want to do those 20, ten, twenty, thirty thousand dollars a month that everybody else is doing. It's time for me to um to step my game up in 2023, and I want all you guys to do the same um as well. I know how to do this. I just haven't had the time because of jobs and stuff like that. You know, I'm doing this part time, but I'm moving this more. 2023 and 2024 is about making this full time. All right. So follow me. 
my my two year anniversary for the channel is coming up. Thank you for all you guys who follow me for the two years. All right, I hope I've given you some good value over the couple years. Um, and that's it. So this this is a good copy. This is sealed. Twenty three ninety nine. Okay, so that's 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 a good copy that I like that so far. Let's go here. Let's look at the DVD. It says thirty eight thirty forty two ninety nine. So what I like to do is I really I really sometimes I don't trust those DVDs. I'm not sure how Amazon listed yet. So what I do is take the UPC code and I'm going to go to my Amazon Seller Central just to make sure that that's the right one, exactly the right one. Uh, Amazon Seller Central. And I'm going to click here. Amazon Ad Products. And I'm going to click here and here. All right. Rank is fourteen thousand, which is fine, with, which is perfectly fine. Um, this is it. So that is the same uh, right there. Okay, it's the same one. And the price is um, twenty three ninety nine. I have tax exempt from eBay. If you haven't done that already, you must do that. Just, just Google tax exempt. You get your tax exempt form from your state, um, guys. I've have people have asked me before about getting tax exempt in their state. I know Florida. Um, I know New York, but I did New York, but that was like, oh my god, twenty years ago. So I don't know what the rules are there now when I lived in New York. All right, let's click analyze and buy bot pro. Buy bot pro, if you don't know, is something similar. If you've heard of Seller Amp. This is one, the one I, I just like the layout of this better than Seller Amp for me. Some people like Seller Amp, but it shows you almost the same type of information. Six dollar forty two cent profit. I'm happy with that. Let's go down and just analyze, make some more analyzations. It says estimated seventy eight sales month. So far, the month of December has had thirty eight sales. November was seventy four, sixty eight, fifty nine. So we're averaging fifty, you know, fifty five to seventy five sales a month. January of twenty two. It really sold thirteen hundred. One of the movies must have come out last January. That's probably why. Um, one of those um, what's the, what's the, the Fantastic Beast movie? Maybe thirteen hundred. Wow. So what I want to do is I want to go back to all time. I want to look at the sale. Yeah, this thing was selling hotcakes. January, March, January. Here. Yeah, this thing was selling like hotcakes all the way to October. It's been, so this this DVD set's been selling for a couple of years. It hasn't stopped. I look at the sales heat map. It's it was bright red back this time. It's a little more orange. It's selling a little more now. Um, yeah, this is worth a purchase. Let's look at the. Um, I'm not looking at FBM anymore. I'm not doing any more FBMs unless the unless the company is on the listing. All right, I bet Amazon's on this listing at 62. Look at 62 dollars, right? Let's look at Prime, 74. So if I send this in Prime for, I'm going to send it Prime for a higher price, 59.99. I'm going to send it, I'm going to compete with Amazon on the listing. All right, it's $20 profit. This is a good, a good purchase. I've sold a couple things, FBM, that Amazon was on the listing and it sold. So this to me is a good purchase. This is $20. Purchase here. By the way, we started at 8.30 p.m. Time is 8.37 now. It's $20. I'm just rounding it down 20 bucks. Let's see how much we're going to do today. All right. I am going to take this uh, listing and I am going to add to cart. And we'll sit there, right there. All right. Let's look at the Waltons. $59. Now, I just bought the Game of Thrones set. I'll tell you, I'm, I'm letting you know the DVDs I'm, I'm getting. I don't mind if you go get them too. I got the Game of Thrones set perfectly wrapped, and nice and neat. Um, that's going in. I paid about 60 bucks for it. It's selling for about, I know I paid a 40, $40 for it. It's selling for about $80, $89 on Amazon. So I I've, don't want to do another, and I, and I, I don't want to do another high priced one again all right i should have put the sales on rank to keep it the dvds under 25 dollars so i'm gonna skip this for now but if you didn't want to skip it let's check it let's just pretend i was gonna buy it five a little bit available look at that that's that's wrapped he's uh, i don't know where these guys get this stuff from all right from montgomery new york 
he probably got that uh, some kind of liquidation sale. All right, let's look at the. Uh, Excuse me, that's definitely the same thing. That's $99 here and Walton's $59.69. If I were to buy this, I'm not buying this, but first one of you guys could come. He's got five of them. If somebody's going to come in there and drop uh, 300 bucks on there, you could probably make some good money on this. All right. Then I hope my internet doesn't... Well, right now I'm not worried about my internet because I'm recording on my computer, but my internet... Spectrum's been upgrading our internet to hot, super high speed, but they've been messing with me for two days now. I'm gonna try to get some work done. <laughs> All right, there we go. All right, just had to refresh the page. Fifteen dollars on that one because it's a big box set, heavy. Ninety-nine is the cheapest price. This sells. Okay, here we go. So this sells seventy-two a month. I have it on Prime only. I'm sure a bunch of people have it. FBM this. Um, there's 79 in stock, only 11 sellers. This is this is a fantastic look at the uh, look at the drops. Look at the BSR drops, fantastic. Amazon's not on this listing. Whoa, I'm gonna have to reconsider this one. One five after six, it goes up. I could sell this for 124 dollars and get rid of it in a week. This is a 15 dollar profit one. Now the ROI on it is 26%. This is this is type of stuff you think I don't want to do it right now. I want to keep I want to keep my I want to get more right now my aim is to get more SKUs. All right. Here's what I know I'm going to get. I looked at this before I started recording. <gasps> and this is what happens when you wait people. I wanted to record and show this. This was a good one here. The person who bought this is a... There's no way that the West Wing... I don't know. Oh, that sucks. Well, it was a good buy. It was like $6 or something. Seven, eight, eight, yeah, it was a little more. It was $8, $9. All right. I don't know what this DVD new thing... When I click on the 2,000 mules here, it gives me a page. When, even when I put in the UPC code, I keep seeing this pop up. And this looks like it would be a great deal here. But it's not showing up okay elvis presley that is the same dvd disc trouble with girls all right that is 9.95 let me close these out here let me leave the amazon seller central up Trouble 9.95 is brand new as i asked for brand new looks like it's a picture yeah they put it on a white background that's that's not a stock photo yeah that's not a stock photo all right let's uh let's get the upc code UPC code, put it up here, and what is trouble? We got two listings. This is okay. So let's click on this first listing. It looks like it has a ranking there and stuff. Um, twenty one forty seven. Price is not. Oh, price was ten bucks. That's fine. Ten bucks. Let's check the rankings on this exact listing right here. This is the listing I want. Five dollars forty-eight cents. Yeah. Uh, look at Prime. Remember Prime? It's one one one. It sells. You do want to see FBM sells in, in um in here. You could see here's FBM. All right, but these drops here. Yeah, it drops. Let's look at the past seven days. It's got two FBM sales, but it's got drops here. It's got a drop here, drop here. So it's been selling. Okay, yeah, it's been selling. Up, then drop, up, drop. And a lot when it's a long drop, it probably sold a couple. You know. All right. If the price has been going down, then up. Is that the price? Yeah, that's the FBA price. All right. I like this one. Um, it's only it's a fifty percent. It's five dollars. I'm gonna add that to cart. Where are you at? Add to cart. I do like that one. You start getting doing this pretty quick and getting good at this. So that's five dollars. That's twenty five dollars for ten minutes. Let's look at some more here. 
Let's get rid of this page. Let's get rid of this page here. All right, what's this, Mr. Ed? Oh, Mr. Ed, a horse is a horse, of course, of course. Now this is thirty-five dollars. I didn't know was the plan going this high, but if this is a good, this is a ten thousand rank average. One available, one sold in twenty-four hours. This is so my, okay, <laughs> Mr. Ed. Now this is a. I wish they would take pictures of the actual one. This is a uh, set, but they say it's brand new. I'm just gonna read down here. DVD is still like there's still a shrink wrap right? disc. DVD set is like new, still in shrink wrap condition. This the, the flag's not all the way red, it's a little bit pink, it's going that way. I would just, I wish that if you're gonna put something that's brand new here. And you say still like new down here that you would have took a picture of the actual disc. So I'm going to skip this one because I don't feel like returning it. And everything has a 30 day return. I don't feel like returning it. Um, so I'm going to skip that one. In fact, what I want to do is go back here. I didn't read the uh, got to read the description of this stuff, fellas, people, ladies and gentlemen. Um, the future stand behind my product. Make a mistake. This person's. Uh, Big time seller here, there, Oscar, triple feature, one problem, condition new, format one. Okay, I'm going to go with it. They, they, they look like they're a legit good seller. Iron Man 2, $3.28. No case, DVD only, no case, no artwork. Okay, skip that. Rick and Morty, complete seasons, one of... So why, then why do you list this as new if you're going to do that? You see, this is what aggravates me about some sellers sometimes. Oh, it's a, it's a, it's a bidding. Well, why do you, you can't list that as new. I place the disc in a paper sleeve and mail it just like Netflix. It's not new because some people want the casing with the, with the, with the thing. You can't do, you can't do that. All right. Even though you've put that in the description, your picture shows something else. They can return it at your expense. I just want to let you know if you're the person, if you're Kelf thought, Kelfotch, if you see this video and the person gets that video, gets that, and they didn't see the description, they can return it at your expense because of your picture here. Just let all you guys know on eBay. Use a stock photo if you have a sealed product. Otherwise, you can use a stock photo if you have a sealed product. Otherwise, if that product's touched, take a picture of the piece itself. I would take a picture of the piece itself anyway. On my eBay store, I have um, you know, over 500 items right now. I have a lot of stock photos of stuff. I make the mistake one time of putting a stock photo for something that wasn't quite, it was sealed, but it wasn't quite the, the item it was. I took the wrong stock photos and put them up. Um, it was only a $10 item. I refunded the person. But even I make the mistake. But let's not do this, guys. Can't do that. All right. At least put a second picture. You know, but this is the picture that you're watching Iron Man 2 with um, Black Widow, with, with, with fine-ass Scarlett Johansson, and, and uh, you know, the Rhodes, and, and Pepper, and Tony Stark, and all that good stuff. All right. All right, let's go down to Rick and Morty. We're going to look at Rick and Morty. It says New Sealed here. Rick and Morty see stock photo. Now we're going to go down. New sealed. It says new sealed, so we're gonna trust that. It's twenty four dollars. Oh, did the price come down to twenty four? Okay, go a discount here. Plus five dollars shipping. That's twenty nine dollars. It should add up to twenty nine here. Yes, twenty nine. Now let's go. Let's take this. I don't want to click on the link necessarily for flip mine. There's no problem. I just like doing it this way. If one to five sales rank. Oh, it's a good high sales rank here. A low, very low sales rank. Let's click on it here. $29. We're going to plug that into. We're going to plug that into. Um, and analyze that. $47.93, which should be the low end of the cost. But I'm not going to sell it for $7.48. It says 25% ROI, which I'm cool with. Oh, $1,000. Mm. All right. So that's why Amazon's on there for $58.54. So what I want to see. FBA forty eight ninety five. Somebody bought it. You know, there's a um. So 
something about Bywap Pro that I'm missing. There's definitely something about Bywap Pro that I'm missing. And I'm going to figure it out. It's the sellers. It is the sellers. It's the percentages. And I know I've seen it before. And then what, subscribe, please. Give me a like or whatever. There's a future video I'll come up. And I'm going to explain. We're going to go over Bybot Pro in a lot more detail. I've done a little bit of it before. Um, total cost. Here, but you see the buy box. You know what? Here's the buy box analysis. This is telling you whether Amazon shares the buy box and it's green. That means they're sharing it. I could tell by all the FBM sales that they're sharing the buy box. And they're sharing with FBM, they're sharing with FBA. So Amazon selling it for $58. One here, four here. I would just sell it for probably between $57 and $58.54. So I'd probably sell it for $57.99. So let's drop the price up there. And analyze. I'm going to have to refresh the page. This stupid internet is killing me here. 57.99. All right. $16. Yep. All right. So I'm going to add that $16. I am going to buy this. I wasn't going to buy a big expensive, uh, more expensive disc, so $16, $29. All right, so Rick and Morty, we're going to add you to the cart. Yes, add to cart. All right. All right, should be three items in the cart there. All right, Rick and Morty. Let's go to another one. This is all, now these are the ones that are all listed today. 25,000 rank, right? The Last Dance, a 10 part documentary event. Free shipping. Oh, this is the Michael Jordan thing here. Now, he took a picture and put it on a white background. He used the Amazon. He used the eBay thing for the white background. <laughs> I don't like using that thing sometimes. I did use it for a blanket that I actually sold. $20.99 plus $349. That totals, and it should be right here, $24.48. Um, this is recent. I watched this uh, crazy documentary, Michael Jordan. All right, let's go down here and let's put in the, 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 man, I wonder if Michael Jordan would say you're not gated in that young man. Um, let's put that in here. All right, let's click on that. 24.48, says 39.99 in Blu-ray. We don't have a DVD. Is this a Blu-ray? It's a DVD. This is a Blu-ray. Like I said, I'm still learning this, this stuff, but if something doesn't match up to me, it's a no. So we'll skip that one. And that's the way you should operate too. Until you start understanding stuff fully, don't just don't do it. Don't risk it. All right. Don't risk twenty-five dollars. Walking Ned Devine DVD widescreen sealed new. This looks like it's going to be a good picture. Walking Ned Devine. That's eleven ninety-nine. I don't know Ned Devine. That is a seal. That is a good disc right there. That's a good disc. I just want to see description about anything. Uh, brand new and sealed. Check with photos. You see the photos of the item you will receive. Please contact me if you have any questions. Okay, you like it. Um, so it's going to securely. All right, $11.99. Let's look at the Amazon listing. Let's go down. Whoops. Let me go down here and get the UPC code. UPC. Bang. Right there. Copy that out. All right. Walking at Devine. $18. This that's the low end right there. So 11, let me see 11 uh where to go? 11.99. Whoops. 11.99. I don't have to put you don't have to put a um a 
period there. Now that's a negative thing. So, but that's the low end right there. But when you start, when it starts negative, I start thinking the eh, seventeen, eighteen, oh three, twenty one dollars. There's thirteen sellers, uh, twenty nine dollars. Looks like it looks like people are tanking the price here. Um, twenty nine dollars is what I would want to sell it at. How many is it selling per month? 50 per month, 25 sales. How many is in stock? Um, seller stock is eight, total stock is 13. I've done it before where I've put price here and then I, you know, of a bunch of items and I put the middle price. All of a sudden I sell out my items because all the low prices went out. There's tanking going on here. Um, maybe some people never heard of they got the disc and they're going to sell it. Oh, this person got it for a lot cheaper. That's what it was. Book Trader. They got it for a couple bucks. And that's the danger with DVDs. Somebody's gonna go scan. If I go scan a brand new DVD in Goodwill for three dollars, I can come here and beat everybody's price, right, and make a better profit than you can on eBay. That's the thing here. So this is making me think. And if it's making me think, the answer is no. Just make it simple. As I get more advanced in this, I will probably consider it more and probably do it. But not now. Let's not do it. All right, let's go here. We're going to go for another 35 minutes. This video is going to be long. We're going for an hour to see how much I actually made. So far, we're at $41, um, and we're at 25 minutes. All right, let's go here. Who makes $40 an hour? Who makes $80 an hour here? All right, Game of Thrones. Now, I got this already. Oh, this is the Blu-ray one. Digital copy. New seal complete. I just bought this. It's in the box outside. I didn't pay $85 for it though. This one is the Blu-ray. Oh, I got the DVD set. I'm not spending this much money tonight. But this is, let's, let's look it up. Let's look it up as if we were going to do it because that's the whole point of this video. Um, let's go punch in here. Game of Thrones Blu-ray. These things are selling hotcakes, I know. Oh, Blu-ray, let's click on it. Let's look it up. Eighty-four ninety-nine. I did look this up before. One forty-nine. I considered it, but I bought the DVD set instead. Cause I, cause if you see the price, um, Buybot Pro will remember price thirty-two dollars. Yeah, guys, this is a uh, this is a definite buy. One forty-nine. Prime. Yeah. Oh my goodness. This is a definite buy. I'm gonna add. I'm not gonna buy it, but I'm gonna pretend that I am. So just so we know the profit, this is thirty-two dollars. Just so that we know. All right, I'm not buying it tonight. But if you if we were to just go ham wilds, I mean, I could bust out one of my credit cards and just buy all these DVDs if I wanted to, and send them in. I'm not doing that though. I'm being a little more careful and picky, and that's the way you should be when you're starting something like this. By the way, the links to Buybot Pro and to Flipmine are linked below, as well as um, as well as um, uh, my reseller Genie, which you should be using to log in all your your transactions. And log in all your um stuff for Amazon and or and or eBay and Mercari, whatever what have you. All right. Uh, DVD secrets to a super memory. Um, I forgot what that said. Oh, DVD secrets to a super super memory. Yeah. Oh, I forgot what that said. Oh, DVD secrets to a super memory. Okay, let me stop playing around. All right, sixteen ninety nine, volume one. Let's close this. Let's close these here. That looks like a good sealed here. Mentalist and Illusionist. Oh, okay. That looks interesting right there. All right. Secrets to a Super Memory. Let's see if it's the same th disc. That looks like the same disc. 1740. All right. What I'm going to do. See, I don't like, always like that, that, uh, thing here. That's probably not, this is probably not going to work out. He might be selling it for a very high price. Seventeen I don't think so. Seventeen ninety nine is gonna work too well. I mean seven new and this doesn't even have a rank. Hmm. 
Nah, that's a no. Eh, so I don't even have to look any further. That's a no right off the top of my head. Return to Lonesome Dove 2 disc DVD movie set. Okay, John Voight. Oh yeah, little Ricky Schroeder and John Voight there. All right, 1595. This looks like a sealed, sealed. These guys find these sealed movies like that, man. I would love to go and find a bunch of sealed movies in there. All right. I'm going to turn on Lonesome Dove. What is this? Is a lot of people sell on, the, on eBay. They don't want to bother to get ungated. They probably tried. It's, it, Amazon's a different beast, guys. I have a bunch of ungating guides. I remind you every video I make, you go to my channel, um, go to the front page of my channel, and you'll see my ungating guides. If you do it from a computer, you shouldn't be watching it on your phone. It's a lot. It's a lot of information. So be watch, you'll be doing it on a PC, uh, a laptop, even a tablet, you can do it. But try to do it on your small phone and, and, and read those videos. It's, it's, it's a pain. So I'm from a long. Um, $24.84. What's the price on this? It is... Uh, whoops. I, I accidentally closed that by mistake. Uh, $15.95. Let's see. $15.95. This one, I'm not going to the UPC code. I went right to it. That's, that's the video. It's the right one. All right, and five cents. This is so far. This is a low price here. I don't like. I want the low price to get me some ROI, even if it's lower than my expected ROI. I wanted to get a higher profit. I would like to see a minimum of four dollars there at the low end, so that way I know I have room if I price it up higher. So if I have to get rid of something, I'm gonna lose money on this, right? If I have to get if there's three months coming up and I have to get rid of it, I'm gonna lose money. I don't want to do that. So let me look at the prices. Maybe one person tanking. Look at Prime only, $29.90, $45. Now look at these here. Now, this goes out, the person gets it same day or next day or something, or two days or something like that. These, they don't. Now these prices are all low. This is a little bit of a, of a, of what do you do? Because the price I would sell it at would be $39.99, right? That would put me in the middle on a prime. I gotta refresh. Look at the forty-four ninety-eight. Just what happened? Wait, hold on a second. Let me refresh again. Hit analyze. I gotta let me wait till it all loads up. Hitting it too quick. Seventeen dollars. Okay, what happened to the low one there? It came at forty four ninety eight. Is this DVD? Forty four ninety eight. Now this is a deal right here. If I did it for thirty nine. I gotta look at the FBMs. Let's look at the sales. FBM. Look at these low. Look at these tanking prices for FBM. Come on, guys. John Voigt. This Angelina Jolie's father. Ricky Schroeder. I remember Silver Spoons. That's how old I am. I just gave away my age, everyone. Um. Boom. 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 Ooh, you starting to make me think too much here. The buy box. The buy box has been twenty-five dollars. I don't like it. I don't like it. No. Okay, that's a no. Batman, a long Halloween. Blu-ray, $10.99, $26.90. These are popular. Is the digital code in there if it's sealed? This makes me nervous with, with the stuff with the digital codes because if it's missing, if I try to sell this on Amazon, it will get returned if the code's missing, right? And it takes more than 30 days and you can't return it back here either, right? Um, just starting to make me think too much, but, I'm, but I kind of like this 
first of all, let's go. Let's go get the UPC code. Let's do that. All right. Uh, Batman the Long Halloween. Let's click here. I kind of like this. I might. It says brand new. Because if it comes open, this is $6. Buy box analysis is back. Yeah, they're on there. And Amazon. Is Amazon sharing the buy box? Yes, they are. I'm going to pass seven days. Let me see. Let me look at the past 30 days. Price been going here. Amazon selling for $26.29. The buy box is here. Here's Amazon here. All right. Have they been sharing the buy box for the most part? On occasion. Not as regularly as third party sellers would prefer. All right, that's a no. See, that's I just want to point that out on BuyBot Pro. See that right there? If that's not green, don't buy it. That You want that to be green. All right, let that be green. Amazon's on the list in green. They're saying they're sharing it. Go for it because they can actually see when Amazon's selling it and when everyone else is selling it. So they're not sharing this. Um, I'm not worth the, the trouble for six bucks. Nope. Nope, nope, no. So we're we got 25 minutes left to go. Let's see. Inspector Morse Complete Series. I like these 17 disc boxes. Reach of one. Whoa. Let's see the condition. That looks like he took his picture. That is not a stock photo. He took his pictures to one. Oh, look at this for 25.88, and this was 23.89. All right. So I've got this watched here. Probably one of our guys. Uh, Watching my videos. All right, let's uh, let's go down here. Let's pull up UPC. All right, bang, click that. All right, uh, there's two listings here, so we're gonna go with the listing that's the thousand rank here. Thirty-three people on it. We're gonna click on that. Um, what was the price here? Fifth, did I look at this before? I must have looked at this before. 23.89. I didn't buy it. I must have looked at this like maybe a couple weeks ago. Because if I have the price, it shows up there. It's showing it's showing the price already up there. So $3.16. This is the low end. Now we're borderline. This is a borderline. Amazon's on the listing. Now it's green. But Amazon's the low price at $39.99. Alright. Yeah, Amazon's the low one. Amazon's the low price. I don't care if it's green. That thing, that's a no. That's why, that's why I didn't. That's exactly why I didn't do it. All right, so let's go to the next one. Crime scene investigating TVT. Factory sealed. CSI. Huh? Okay. Complete box series. Let me just, hmm, this is interesting here, because even though this is not a match, or is it? <sighs> yeah, you know what, no, I'm not going to spend $40 to find out. It's a little bit uh, it's out of my ways here. Moby Dick, nineteen fifty six DVD, two thousand one. Look at this, thirteen ninety nine. All right, that's it. that guy's holding it. He's showing you this is. I. Uh, why does that box look so much small in his hand? Now that's a DVD. That's a sealed DVD. That's a good one. All right, so far the product is good. All right, let's go here. Let's punch in. Let's see what the price is. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so here's a now. When we have an NAN here, that means it's not available. That means it's not in stock anymore. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to punch in thirteen ninety nine, and I'm going to put a price here of twenty nine. I'm just making up a price. All right, doesn't matter what you put here. 
Now, we're, this is very important. I'm glad this happened. So on BuyBot Pro, it's going to show no one has it in stock. You're going to be the only one on this listing. No API available. Oops, API. Of course there's API. That was just a glitch. All right. So if I sell for $29.99, that's $6.39. Now, there is no one on the listing. It's sold out. It is gone. There are two. There were two sellers. Um, says there were new offers too, but they're probably on their way in. All right. Let's look at the prices it was selling for. Let's see what the buy box says here. It's going to uh, $19.99 to as high as $30. Bucks. I guess $29.99, right? What do you guys think? What do you guys think? For six thirty nine, thirteen ninety nine, Adventures of Moby Dick. Is that the yeah? Gregory Peck. Why is it? Do you look. Yeah, that's it. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! No one's on the listing. It says it sells. Where are the monthly? Where are the monthly sales? Hit that again. BSR drops. This sold this sold as recently as yesterday. The last one sold yesterday. Um the FBA price was I'm not gonna do it. <sighs> I'm not gonna do it. If it was something that was like a 30, 20, 15, 20, 25 dollar, I would do it. I don't want to do it. We saw that time for for that. Okay, Disney to Pooh, great search for Christopher for Robin. Nineteen ninety nine. That's twenty three dollars and forty eight cents. That is sealed. Good one here. Let's get rid of this. Let's go down to the UPC. The UPC code here. This is why. This is why their VAs are. <laughs> This is why you hire a VA, right? At some point. This can't be tedious, but guys, you got... Well, what am I doing? I'm stupid. Oh, I see $5.21. Hold up. I, I... DVD, good. It's pre-owned. Okay, that's why. Nope. All right, let's punch it in here. I'm not messing with pre-owned stuff. There's some people that do. I'm not doing it. Apply to sell. Oh. Winnie the Pooh is Disney, ain't it? I'm not ungated. Am I not ungated? Buena Vista Home Video Branded. <laughs> there we go, guys. Got approved. Bam. Just like that. You see? That was easy. Bam. Get approved. Sometimes you just got to ask. You never know, right? <laughs> All right, sell this product. There it is. There it is. All right, so what's this selling for here? What am I getting it for here? Oh, all that. I'm talking all that mess. <laughs> I can't make no money on it. <laughs> 23.48. Hold on, watch this. <laughs> all that mess. I ain't making no money. But I'm, at least I won't get it in, uh, in that company's DVDs. $1.12. That's the low end. Let's see if only one person is selling at that price. $34.95. Thirty-four ninety-five. This one person who is selling thirty a month. Ooh, thirty-nine ninety-nine would make it more worth my while. Offers there, thirty-nine ninety-nine. I would actually put it up to forty. See, I would put it here at forty-two. I would match that forty-two ninety-four. Is what I would do. Forty-two point ninety-four. That's what I would do here. I would match that, and let's see what the what we got. Seven ninety-one. That to me is a buy. Ugh. Then I look at my ROI, thirty-three percent. It's eight bucks. Add to cart. Let's do it. All right, let's go to another one here. We got about seventeen minutes. All right, the pianist. 
Uh, let me move. Let me move my ugly face up here real quick. All right, the pianist. Um, DVD 2003, $8.99. Come on, give me a low price disc. Brand new, $8.99. Oh, come on, please, please, please be bra actually brand new. I hate new. Know, it's $8.99. If it's if it's a profit, if it's a profitable one, I'm gonna I'm gonna get it. $8.99. Can I sell this? No. Uh-oh. Now, here's something you can do also from Bybot Pro. So you can actually, this connects into your Amazon seller account. So if I click auto on gate and... <laughs> when you have an when you when you sell, you have a good record on Amazon, they just start saying yes. Let me tell you, if people complain, you get ungated and sell. Sell books, don't go sell stuff, man. And then just ask permission. You know, I bet you, I'm, there's toy, major toy brands that I'm not ungated and I haven't tried yet. I bet you, and there's been some, I forgot one, what's that toy brand that I got ungated in without sending in, uh, without sending, was it Fisher Price? I got ungated in Fisher Price without sending in any Fisher Price stuff. They, Amazon, if they trust you, they're going to let you sell. All right? All right, so eight ninety nine twenty seven eleven fifty one. This is a let's oh let's look hold on, once one prime seller. One prime seller. That's what I'm doing. Prime. Oh, you're a buy. Uh, look at the buy box there. The buy box has gone as far down as nine sixty six. FBM. Some doof goofus wanted to get rid of it. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not playing that game. Nine sixty six, twenty seven dollars, twenty five. Hmm, this uh, price is really inconsistent. Nineteen ninety five. I can do nineteen ninety five. I think I can. Yeah. Uh, seven dollars. I can go down this. What the hell? It's only eight ninety nine, right? And the pianist add to cart. All right. Let's do that. I'll get my 1% cash back off of that. Fantastic Beast of Secrets of Dumbledore. Blu-ray, digital, and slipcover. So they're telling you everything's here. There's a there's a ceiling inside. Okay, it's the outer box with the ceiling inside. Now, okay, like that's the slip. That's the outside. It's a slip cover. Everything's there. Just want to check his description. Brand new factory seal. Free trip. Beautiful. Okay, so let's check our price. One available, one sold. All right, and let's take this UPC to Amazon. How much was the other pianist that I that I say it was? It was um the twenty seven ninety six. We're gonna call it. We're we're gonna cut cut it down a little bit. I'm gonna just say ten dollars on that one. All right, fantastic beasts. I wanna take this. I wanna take it this here. Uh, let me move my ugly face, ugly mug down here. Hey, wow, what a what a low sales rank. All right, Amazon's on this listing. Um, price, thirteen fifty. Let's close this one out. I'll confuse myself here. Thirteen fifty. Five cents at that price. Let's see what the. Let's see what the. Twenty-two ninety-nine was Amazon selling it for. That's a no. I want. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna sell it above Amazon's price. Yeah, no, make no sense. That's a no. Okay. So once we run out of those, right? We're back to the thirteenth of December. It doesn't matter. Twelfth of December, we can load more. We can just load more, and then it's gonna check all of these and then see what I'm gated in. 
and when I'm gated, remove the 13 of these that I'm gated in. Remove them. Let's start here. Phantasm Blu-ray. Why is there no image available? Okay, there's no reason. Okay, let's close these all out. We got 12 minutes. All right. You guys saw me get instant ungated in two in two um, DVD brands, right? And cool. All right. And let's click the here. Let's check. Oh, that's gone. That's the thing. So that's the the negative about Flipmine is that you can't go back too far, too far in days. You just can't. It's stuff's gonna be gone. It's still gonna be showing here, but it'll be sold out. But what I'm gonna do. So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm not. I'm not done with your sheet. I'm not done with you yet. I'm gonna get the listing. Where's the listing? See product details. All right. I'm gonna get the listing. There's the UPC code. I'm gonna take the UPC code. I'm gonna put it in eBay. And I'm gonna see if anybody else got it. Okay. Somebody right here. Oh, this guy. This place is a major seller. So I'm gonna sort it. Price below shipping first. It's got to be new. $16.99. So this guy has it right here. Bang. All right. So even though it said it was out, all right, then I'm going to take the UPC code again just to make sure. I'm going to close that. I'm going to put the UPC code. It's so UPC. So this is a Blu ray now. All right. And there this is now. So what I did was I didn't find the one that I wanted sold out, the DVD sold out, but I took the UPC code and it took me to the Blu-ray and I found it. Now let's see, we don't know the price of this because this exact item is not showing or hasn't shown yet in Flipmine. So we just did our own side research based on that. Um, it's very important that you guys just think outside the box like that all right let's click on this here it's 16.99 and we thought outside the box right into a no profit situation all right buy box analysis good uh, all right 34 cents let's see if that's just a uh 30.99 26.40 30.99 now if we put that up to 30 30 dollars and 99 cents if we match them because by amazon sharing the buy box $4.24, 24% ROI. So that's a no for me. All right. All righty then. Okay, Laurel and Hardy. Central DVD collection. It's like Laurel and Hardy. And that is uh, sealed. That is plastic sealing around there. Look at that. Yep, that's plastic sealing. That's plastic sealing. Yes, yes, two available. Sometimes they have two available and you can just buy two, you know, just buy them out. They Sometimes you can message them and say, hey, would you give me, if I buy both of them, could I get them both for 40 bucks? They'll be like, Shh. most of them are like, yeah, you know, take it off my hands. I appreciate it. Some of them are like, no. All right, let's do, let's check on this. We'll check this link here. That looks like the same link, Essential Collection. But as I like to do it, I like to go to the UPC code. Let's see if we're gonna actually make money on this. Guys, when you do a flip mine, completely ignore the, the FBA prices you see here. Check it on your own. Don't go off of that. I mean, they lag, it does lag behind. All right, um, click on this. 38.8. See, at one time it was selling for 46, but let's see if 24.99, right? This is why you ask for the discount. All right, 24.99. That's what it was selling for, right? Yep, 24.99. $1.27. See, you ask for the discount because if you get it for 20 bucks, maybe it may make it worth it, right? But again, we're going to look 626 if you get it for $20 each. Um, somebody's got it here for thirty nine oh nine. This forty four right here, he's gonna be owning that buy box for a long time. All right. Um. So watch these guys when they take the price like this. Look, you could tell, price tankers. 
I mean, this so easy to tell. This 75 sellers. Oh, no, that's, um, nine, I'm sorry, 19. 13 prime sellers and 6 merchant fulfilled. 75 in stock. Man. No. All right, that's a no. Takes a while, guys. There's that DV2000 mule thing, the nightmare before Christmas. I would love to get this, but I'm not even going to mess with this because Christmas is, is uh, today's the 15th. Christmas is in 10 days. I'm not getting any Christmas stuff right now to send it. Because I, I don't know how long it would sit. If it can sit. It can't have it sit to next year. All right. Downtown Abbey Season 1 and 2, limited edition. This is complete collection. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to go $12.99 plus this. So this is uh, $13 plus $6, $20. Bucks. We'll just say $20 bucks season 1 and 2. I'm going to get the UPC code because it gives me an idea. I'm going to put the UPC in here. Season 1, uh, the complete collection. Was there only two seasons? Okay, I'm confused here. Seasons 1 and 2. This is not the same thing. I don't care what the UPC says. That is not. Nope. All right. Um, no. Okay. So here's here's this. What if I. I'm thinking outside the box here. So what if I take the Amazon code. The UPC from Amazon. Go back to eBay. Punch in eBay. Do you think that maybe one of the listings will be the complete collection? Like that one? Hmm. You see what I did there? So I went to the, took the UPC code for Amazon, punched it in eBay. This is the one I was originally looking at right here. That UPC code they have for that, maybe it's right, maybe it's wrong, but here it is right here. All right, now we're talking. 2419, nine sold. That is it. Anything, anything in the description about brand new factory sealed shrink wrap. All right, um, boom. So this looks like a good one right here, baby. All right, so I'm going to take that UPC code. I'm going to punch that back into Amazon one more time. It didn't change, so this is it for sure. All right, the complete collection. This is the listing I want to go on right here. All right, and what's the price? 4202. Oh, oh hell no. Limited edition. Oh, there's a limited edition. See, you got to look for that stuff, guys. This is not a limited edition. I click on this. Ah, uh, uh, da da da. That's a no. Get a lot of no's before you get some yeses. We're gonna do one more, and that'll be almost an hour. All right. Uh, the closer. Season one, five forty nine, nine fourteen. God of high school. Let's look at one. Let's look at one of these. Let's look at this thirty dollar profit one here. All oh, the classical stretch. Let's scroll down. Let's look at this eleven dollar one. Inspect the Norse again. The one hundred. I I we watched this. This is a good. I like this show. Not a whole lot of people did thirty ninety nine. Star Trek Picard season two. Five forty. I'm just taking a wild thing. I do want to do one more, so let's just go for the next one here. Let's do the closer. Um this is only five dollars and forty nine cents. Two yeah, there why 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 is that so cheap? Played one time. DVD is not mint is not brand new, people. <laughs> It's not brand new. Stop that. That's annoying, man. It's, you play the DVD. It's not brand new. You can get all your stuff returned. God of High School Blu-ray. This person's holding the disc in their hand. It's sealed. Right? Eleven ninety. Three available, one sold. Whenever I see one of these that are sold, I'm thinking, who, who's buying this DVD? Somebody bought it to resell on Amazon. All right. Um, let's go. Let's go here. This is the last one we're going to search for. All right. UPC. 
Um, let me go here. Click on that. God of High School. All right, 24 Newman used. Let's look at this. I it was selling for eleven dollars and ninety cents. Eleven ninety. Analyze. Yeah. Let's see the low end. It's selling. No, nope, Amazon selling for nineteen ninety nine. Can't do it. Can't do it. All right. Um. Heck, one more. <laughs> Phantom of the Opera. 822.26. No, let's go for some one of these more expensive. Let's let's do let's do the 100. I know that show. I like that show. Um, it's a good show. That does that look like it's sealed? That is not sealing around there. Brand new. Watch this. Watch it. They have eight available. New sealed. Oh yeah, there's a plastic right, right here. Okay, I see the plastic. Whoa, that was a hard one to look at. All right, okay, so they have the press price. Look at all these down here: thirty nine, thirty nine, thirty one dollars, thirty dollars and ninety nine cents. They did that to beat those prices. All right, so let us get the UPC. The Amazon UPC. Rank is six thousand. Sixty one dollars. All right, thirty one dollars. That's what I'm buying it for. Thirteen dollars profit. Eighty six. Amazon selling for eighty six dollars. How much does it sell per month? Ninety nine a month. This guy got 33 of them selling for $61. I will pop the price up to near Amazon levels and see what happens and I can adjust it back down because you can make money at $61.49 as you can see here. But I would pop the price up. Amazon is selling them for and Amazon's sharing the buy box. Buy box analysis. They're sharing the buy box like crazy. All right. Uh, I would just... I'm gonna do in between this. I'm buying this this for, for sure. Um, 69, 61. Oh, let's do. Let's put it at. Uh, let's put it at seventy one ninety nine. All right. Let's just put that there. That's what I would sell it for. I could hold it all onto it for a while for that for that price. I don't know why this gets stuck sometimes. $31. So $22. $22. I'm going to surround that down to $20 and we're going to stop here. All right. So guys, I'm going to let me just add this to my cart. All right. So what I did tonight, minus the $32, but if I, you know what, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to buy that one, all right? If I were going full blast, I would have made 25, 41, 73, 81, 91, 111 dollars in one hour's work, all right? Take a break, you get up, you eat lunch half hour you come back and do another hour's work the last time i did this i made eighty dollars in one hour this time is 111 dollars in one hour guys this is why we get this is at some point you want a va to do this for you you want to do this enough you got to do this over and over it is tedious but when you see the numbers 111 dollars and you see numbers like that that you can do when you send them in and it's a little it's little by little by little by little and it grows that i've seen these guys do it i've seen rake and profit do it and i've seen i mean i've been following him for seven years i've seen um all these guys on fba do it i've seen them you know some people go from i see caught some people starting at like five to ten thousand dollars a month not doing a million dollars a year in sales and stuff like that um 20 teen vas and stuff like that i will have a va one day who's doing this for me um, giving me the stuff, but I want to make sure that I'm able to spend $500 a day. And when I get to that point, 
I will be hiring a VA and stuff like that. But in the meantime, just do this over and over yourself. Buy these little pieces. Take them, send them in. I'm, 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 I'm getting one, two, three, four, five, six. When I get the six discs, I'm not going to, I'm not going to sit there and um, I'm pulling out the hundred eleven dollars because minus thirty two is nine seventy nine dollars. So I did eighty dollars an hour again, right? So what, for me, eighty dollars is what I did. For you, if you had went and, and bought that other disc, you'd have made one hundred eleven dollars. So you take the 80 bucks, and when that 80 bucks comes in, when those pile of discs come in and another one comes in, I just send them off. I'm going to keep sending them off. Keep feeding the beast over there in FBA until it builds up and the money comes rolling back in. All right? So, guys, this is Gary D for DIY Dollar Bills. Please give me a thumbs up. Like, subscribe. All the links are below that you need. BuyBot Pro, Flipmine and everything you need and guys i am getting a little bit thirsty you know i should have kept some water with oh crap i forgot i have a snapple here <laughs> i got a snapple lemonade oh, all right that was better so guys get um get busy get to work and i'll see you in the next video peace when you need someone easy to talk to i will be there to give you help Please change your mind world easy Negativity is like an option When you need someone easy to talk to